and welcome back to Let's Play Mempar the Masquerade Bloodlines. I'm back here in my apartment. Well, looks like the boards are lighting up. And uh, another popular one. Let's me see. too. Meeny, 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 Who will be the lucky Go see caller? Arthur You've got the first shot at Deb tonight. So, who do and, I have the pleasure of speaking to? Hi, Deb. This is, uh... I also need to see... I need to go to the blood bank. Why are you up so late? And, uh... No mail for me. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Uh, let's see. The Lily evidently went to the blood bank, so I should look there for some clues. I need to tell Arthur about uh, my Durban. Uh, you know, that I went to his apartment and listened to the recording. And, uh, so, yeah, I want to go see Arthur first. I figure that won't take very long, and then I'll go to the blood bank. If you're new to town or just new to this whole radio thing, <laughs> look at this to little pooch. The dead of night. The only girl who will spend the night with you. Hello, the Arthur. Person. How are you today? Hey there, hot stuff. No, oh, yeah, hot stuff. That's me, right? Yeah. <laughs> I got some info about Muddy. So what'd you find out about Muddy? <laughs> Uh, flood somewhere uh, downtown. All right then, I'll have to call in some bounty hunters to help me find money and a couple of other jumpers. Thanks for all your help. How many boats do you own? Uh, you can thank me. Uh, yeah. Um, how about that money you promised me? Oh, right, right, right. Sorry about that. Here you are. Thanks. See you around then. If you ever find yourself or a loved one locked up, please call. I will later. So. Yeah. Hmm. Now let's go uh, to the blood bank. Only tempting treats on the way. <laughs> okay. Thirteen stimulants in every bottle. Liquid demon seed. Lobber it down. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Why do I have such difficulty just going through a room? Locked. Okay. Bunsen burner. <laughs> uh, what am I doing here? Just Hello, what, Bunsen you burner. Who are you? What are you doing back here? Uh, if you don't 
No, you shouldn't be asking. Oh, you here for the special sauce? <coughs> what do you think? Okay, stupid question, Phil. She's in the freezer. Today's code is... Think, Phil. It's, uh... Moon landing, uh, 1969. <laughs> uh, 1969, got it. <coughs> Cook up some, some snacks. Some fun, just Bunsen burner. <laughs> well, that was pretty easy. Yeah. This is something about she's in the freezer. I, I don't know who he's talking about, but who else would be in the freezer, you know? Hmm. This looks like it might be the freezer. Check out this. Interesting in any of them. Hey, don't close on in here. Santa Monica Blood Bank Password. How about 1969? Yes. Hmm, what's this? Ah. Oh, blood. Wow. Oh, look at all the blood. It looks like it might be Lily. Lily? Hunger. I need it. A drop of it on my tongue, sliding down my throat. The hot flash in my brain lighting up my body. I can smell it everywhere. Blood. What happened to you? Let me go. It's painful. Like I'm going to die. It's calling. Never felt like this before. Let me go. I can smell it. I have to have it. <sighs> Calm down and tell me who you are. Let me go. Hold still and I'll let you go. You don't look well at all. Oh, sweet mother of God! Ah, <laughs> oh, gee, I was hoping to have him as a snack later on. Don't drain him dry. The heat. Mm, it's never been so satisfying. All of it. I drank until I heard his heart stop and I was sucking on a dry, dead artery. It was euphoric. But I've... I've... killed him. I've oh, never killed anyone before. Good. What happened? What came over me? When the beast took over, it happens. Beast? What is that? Why couldn't I stop myself? Why did it feel so right? Shh, calm down, it's all right. I tried to steal some blood. I heard they sold it. I was hungry, and I can't hunt in town. They caught me, and I was trapped, trapped. Thought I'd never escape, but I killed a man. I have to get out of here. Hmm. Who are you? My name is Lily. 
heard about you from E. E? You know E? I... How do you know E? I said I'd help him. Do you, what do you know about Thin Bloods? I tried to tell E about his condition, but he was so furious at me for what I'd made him into, he wouldn't listen. A Thin Blood, from what I've been told, is a vampire whose blood is weaker than most. Go on. Rolf, my sire, told me some vampires consider Thin Bloods a bad omen and want them destroyed. Rolf wasn't a Thin Blood, and apparently I am. I don't know why. Rolf abandoned me. His group wouldn't take me in. They said I was a liability. He left me with so many questions. And I did the same thing to E. But I didn't want to leave E. He forced me out of his life. I... I should go. I have to get out of here. Maybe out of this city. Soon. You should go see E. He said he forgives you and he wants to see you. He doesn't hate me anymore? No, quite the opposite. You should talk to him. I'll go see him. Thank you. You're welcome. Goodbye. Oh, about tonight, what I did? Please, don't tell E. It's not my fault. I couldn't control it. I've never done anything like this before. I'm no killer. I understand. It's not your fault. You couldn't help it. Bye, Lily. Why'd you have to go and let that bitch out? There's one less fill in the world now. Why'd you have to let her go and eat him, huh? No, I'll never get to do in that bastard myself. Well, you know what? No blood for you. No more! What incident? Nothing happened back there. I was just buying blood. Right. A transaction. Green for red. Interested? Yes, I'd like to make a withdrawal. Okay, I need to go and see E and tell him about Lily. my lily back. She told me all about what happened. I don't know why you helped this, but your blood's worth bottling. I'll never let her go again. Thank you. You're welcome, E. Keep her safe. We're gonna be getting out of LA soon. Too dangerous here. Rosa told us something big's about to happen, and I don't want to be here when the Jack comes out of the box. Take that for what you will. Jack comes out of the box? I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> Goodbye, E. Thin blood. It's thick enough to hurt. Hi. How did it go with E? This life's been hard on him. Both of us. But he forgives me. We're leaving soon. I have some family with a place out in the middle of nowhere in Oregon. It should be okay for us to stay out there. As long as we're together. <clears throat> you probably want your stuff back then. Here, take it. Thank you. 
keep your love alive. Get that. Right. You have any of those items you mentioned? Um, I have the special chewing gum for a hundred dollars. Oh, okay. I guess. Here. And, uh, do you need some unicorn blood? Uh, I'll buy as much as you've got. Um, I got three bags. I think I have enough for the procedure now. Thanks for the blood. Just to be sure, you may want to kill the head vampire with this holy stake for a hundred dollars. Yeah, here you go. Uh, now where can I find the head vampire? <laughs> Can't you figure it out? He's president of the United States. You won't have to live like this anymore. I'm going to kill the head vampire. <laughs> Oh, I gotta go find Therese at the asylum. 